and welcome. Thank you for joining me today. My name is Louise Delees, artist and teacher. This is lesson 10 and in today's lesson I'm going to show you how you can construct a basic face. This will need a stick of willow charcoal, charcoal pencil, powdered charcoal, a soft brush, a couple of blending stumps and a kneadable eraser. So let's start like we always do by mapping out the basic shapes. In this case it's an egg shape and we're using this as the head. From there we can place in the hairline, the brow line and the bottom of the nose. From the bottom of the nose to the chin about halfway we'll loosely place the mouth and come back up to the top with the hairline. The brows will indicate the eyes, the nostrils and then we'll come in and work this mouth up a little bit while we're in this area. Now we'll come back in and work up the eyes up a little bit more. I'm using a regular uh, piece of tracing paper here to put over where I've already got the charcoal down and where I don't want that charcoal to move. Uh, as I come back in up to the eyes, as we change tools and pick up our soft brush, we'll start by taking some of the charcoal away from the lines that were made earlier and we'll soften those. Blend that lovely charcoal into the paper as we start to create some form. Let's place the nose, just loosely placing it in there with the brush and the powdered charcoal. So we are sculpting the nose as opposed to drawing the nose on with the charcoal pencil. We're using the powder and the brush to sculpt a nose. We're doing this by being aware of where we're placing the light and the darker tones. Working up all of the drawing now. Coming round with the brush, softening areas. A little bit more work on this nose. Let's come from the bottom, define that a little bit more. Back in with the charcoal pencil, let's define the top of the eyes, the eyelids. We'll indicate the tear duct, the corneas, we'll place the pupils. Let's indicate some top eyelids there. We'll come back and loosely place the nostrils again with the charcoal pencil giving us a slightly darker tone before we swap back to the brush and soften these eyes up a little bit. Now we're coming in with a kneadable eraser. And back to the eyes with a charcoal pencil. So we're going to be working more with the charcoal pencil around the eyes now than anything else. As we said earlier, we're not using the charcoal pencil on the nose, with the exception of the nostrils. We're sculpting the nose area using the powdered charcoal. We're defining the eye area by using the charcoal pencil. We're creating form by building up dark sections with the powdered charcoal and the soft brush. So we're utilizing the willow charcoal in different, in different ways to create different effects. And we can come in and add a few more lights, a few more highlights to certain areas. We're finding a little bit more with the soft brush, a little bit more erasing. It's a constant, moving around the drawing all of the time, defining areas, bringing areas forward, sending parts of the face back, applying lights and darks to the planes of the face to offer an interpretation of the face having form. We'll indicate some eyelashes here. 
the width. We don't want too much details in this area, but we'll just indicate a little bit of lash. If it falls in the wrong place, just pick up your kneadable eraser. A little bit of highlight within the eyes here and a little bit under the eyes. Coming in with a bit more highlight. And let's come in here with a needable eraser and tidy up this drawing a little bit. A little bit of highlight on the top of the brow, around the mouth area. Defining the nose. Let's refine the side of the face. Come back in with the powdered charcoal underneath the nose, just slightly here, just darkening that section off a little bit so we're creating the illusion that the nose is a 3D form. Before we come back in again with the kneadable eraser to take any highlights back out of that section. Always coming back in with the soft brush to soften, soften these areas up, refining them now. Working all areas of the drawing and still utilizing all the different tools we have. Refine a couple of areas here. Always coming back in with the soft brush to soften, soften these areas up, refining them now. Coming in, paying a little bit more attention to what's going on in this nose area here. We'll bring out a highlight there on the nose. Finishing off this drawing, we will call this one complete. Thank you for joining me today. Thank you for watching today. If you have enjoyed the drawing, please give it a thumbs up. This has been lesson 10 in the 10 week part drawing course. I'm going to leave you with a slideshow of the other lessons within this course. If you have enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you next week for another charcoal drawing.